Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back to the Portsmouth Road to Glory. We have Southampton up first. Of course, that is a derby game. Do we even care about Southampton at this point? Come on, they're not even close. Down in 11th place. We must be, what, like 30 points ahead of them? They've got 43. We've got 72. There you go. 29 points ahead. Absolutely smashing them this season. Uh, I might get away with a sim because I want to play the Champions League matches. We've got the semi-finals in this episode. And I've also got a game against Tottenham, which obviously we've got to play against Tottenham. They are one of my... Mm, I don't know how to explain it without being rude. I don't like Spurs. Um, thankfully, Liverpool are three points behind us despite having played an extra game. So the pressure's off us a little bit there. Same with Man City because we were able to beat them. We're now five points clear of them with the same amount of games played. So with six matches to go, we are certainly the favourites to win the league. Let's go ahead and get this derby game done. It's not even competitive, mate. I've actually created a new second team using the 4-2-3-1. Just look at it. We've given captain to Umnoga, of course. He has to be captain. He is the longest serving player, I believe. He's been here since the very beginning. He partners up with Backer. We've got Gilmore and Loftus-Cheek, the two ex-Chelsea guys there. Dumfries at right back, Guerrero at left back. Martinelli, Hogg, Gale and Ian Acho. This is going to be a big win. I'm feeling it. Here we go. 3-0. What?! You have to be kidding me. You have to be kidding me. Sergeant got sent off. 35 minutes in and then we scored to make it 1-0. And then you're telling me in the second half they beat us. I, I don't even know what to say. That is absolutely crazy. So that pressure I told you about that's kind of off me is now back on me. Liverpool... Are level on points having played the extra game now. And Man City have a chance to go within two points if they win their game. And now we've got Spurs. Oh, my God. Oh, why did I do a quick sim? It's, it's dumb. It's dumb. There's no way we should have lost that game. Even with the second team, we should have smashed them. That's not good, guys. I simply have to beat Tottenham. We, we can't drop points here. And we've got the Champions League semi-final first leg right after. So I don't really want to be using my entire first team. So I am going to have to make a couple of changes here. I'm going to bring in Faulkner, for example. Um, didn't mean to press that. Let's go ahead and add in Gale as well. And oh, I have to play Rogers. I have to. Maybe we take Backer out and put in Mega Johnny, Big Johnny. Okay. Cummings on the left. Yes, that's fine. Do I change out Holt? He is one of my key players down that left side. Uh, yeah, I'm going to put in Guerrero for this one. So it is a slightly weaker side, but it should be enough to beat Tottenham. At least I hope so. It does look like they've got Harry Kane. Yep. Oh, God, they're going full strength. I mean, of course they are. They're in fourth place. They want to make sure they secure top four. And they're against a team that, may I remind you, beat them in season two in the FA Cup final. What a shame. They do have some other players in there that maybe you wouldn't expect. Uh, Grimaldo starts, they've got Sanger in midfield, and Didi's there. Oh man, it is a good team. Harry Kane up front is the main problem. It doesn't look like they're using Zaniolo though. Every time we played Tottenham recently, Zaniolo has been insane. So I'm quite happy that he's not starting. Let's just go for it. We've got a lot to lose, but also a lot to gain here. Just get a win against Tottenham. I need it more now than maybe ever, <laughs> other than the FA Cup final. I, I, would, I would lose every game against Tottenham just to keep that memory alive. That was just incredible. Uh, hello, Guerrero, where are you? What the hell? Okay, thankfully Day's there. Guerrero caught forward there. It's okay, let's just get on the break. We've got Nelson powering forward. Put it in behind for Gale. I'm going to give this to Rogers, I think. Mount's making a run. Into Mount. Back to Rogers. No way. How did Christensen get that? Here's Big Johnny now. Driving forward. You don't want to get in his way. He's still going. Dink it in. Oh, for God's sake. Really, that's come off him as well. This doesn't bode well. I've been a little bit unlucky so far. Almost 20 minutes in. We still haven't had a shot. Oh, look at the space for Nelson once again. Now in for Gale. Hello. Bit of a heavy touch. Can you finish it? Oh, wow. 
I, I'm pretty sure I put more power in to lift that. I don't know why it's gone flat on the ground there. It made it way too easy to save. That's more like it, though. At least we're having all of the possession at the moment. Tottenham are definitely struggling to keep us in midfield. Go on, Rodgers. Have a shot. Oh, why did I do that? Why did I do that? And now here come Tottenham on the march. Go on, Nelson. Get in there. Oh, no. Sanger. Trying to switch to the right player. No way. Oh, my God. Guys, this is not going to plan. They're going to score this, aren't they? In comes the cross. They've hit the post. That was close. I'm just thinking now, though. Rodgers is probably the same rating as Harry Kane, if not higher. How mad is that? 35 yards out. Harry Kane with a free kick. I don't know why you'd have Harry Kane taking that. You want him in the box when you whip it in. Nelson's won that header nicely. Here we go. Cummings on the break. We're going to score here. Mark my words. We're going to score here. Lovely pass into Mount. Going to put it on the right here for Big Johnny. And then again over on the right side for James. Play in. Nice. Here we go. We're going to score. We're going to score. On the outside. And again. Still going. Go on. No. Why did it go? No. Why did it go to Cummings there? Rogers is open. He's ready. He's about to shoot. And oh my God. I've got a really bad feeling about this game. And that's another foul? What's going on there? Really? At least the referee gave a yellow card for the tackle in that build-up. To the right back, Wrench. Is that the Ajax guy? I feel like it might be. Either way, it is half time. It's nil-nil here at the Tottenham Hotspur Stadium, whatever they call this place. Harry Kane so far hasn't even had a shot, so we're keeping him quiet. To be fair, we're keeping Tottenham quiet. It has been all us, but we need to do more. And chip that forward to Rogers. Nice. Into Mount. Back to Rogers on the left foot. Oh my god, Sommer. Yeah. That was a pretty good save. Mason Mount with the corner. Day's not going to win that, but it's coming straight back to Mason Mount. Here's Gale. Going to try and turn here. Actually, I'll pass it inside. Here's Faulkner. Don't really want to shoot with my six foot five centre back. Not sure that'll go very well. Here's Gale again. Oh, why am I doing that? Why am I trying to roulette my way into the box? I'm just an idiot sometimes. I really am. Oh, yes, big Johnny. Lovely pass into Cummings. Do I go alone here? No, I don't go alone. I should pass it. What is wrong with me? I'm having such a bad game, guys. I can only apologise that you have to watch this. You have to sit there and watch me play like this. Man City are currently winning 3-0, so they're going to get three points. I'm guessing Liverpool are winning. And at the moment, I am dropping points to my main rival. Honestly, you know, Tottenham have been... Some of the toughest matches we've had. And some of the best matches, to be fair. Please win that. Okay, good. Let's get forward. Need to make some changes soon. Got no one forward with me. What do you want me to do, game? Make a run. There we go. Here we go. Down the left side. Cummings is in. It's going to have to be a cross. Oh, no, no, no. I pull it back. No! Oh, my God. I'm getting frustrated. Calm down, Matt. Calm down. Here is Big Johnny again. Oh, still going. Oh, how do you outmuscle Big Johnny? It's physically impossible. He's got 100 strength. You can't even get 100 strength in this game. He can, though, and that is definitely offside. Let's make those changes now. We have to go with the big guns, don't we? Saka's coming on, talking of big guns. Hasn't scored enough, but maybe he will today. Big Johnny's going to come out for Gilmore. And, oh, no, I don't... I, mm, I didn't put Holt on the bench. Uh, do you know what? 4-1-2-1-2... I'm going to put Iheanacho on instead of Saka. So we're going to have Cummings at Cam, Mason Mount, Nelson, and Gilmore there. Uh, is that going to work? Do you know what? I might try something completely different here. I'm going to go with Dumfries at left back and then swap in with Reese James. Dumfries on that right, Reese James on the left. Let's see if it works. It might not. Slight problem. Um, Reese James is out of position. Oh, but it's okay. They don't want to cross it. It's FIFA 21, remember, guys. They don't really want to cross it. And when they do, it's not normally that good. <laughs> Here's Bergvine now. Day gets stuck in. And he gets the ball. Mason Mount chips it up for Rodgers. Into Iheanacho. Gonna knock it on here for Cummings. Go on, Rodgers. Over the top. No, you idiotic game. Why would you do that? It's okay. Play on. I'm happy it happened. Dumfries can win it here. No. 
I tried to shoot. I then tried to cut back. And yeah, let's not talk about it. No one saw that. We've got 10 minutes. We'll, we'll just win it in a few minutes. It's fine. It seems this stadium just breeds bottlers. If it's not Tottenham bottling it, it's the, the team that comes here. <laughs> At the moment, I could potentially be bottling the league. After having such a decent lead as well. Oh, Gilmore, really? He's won the tackle. Let me have it, game. A few minutes left here. No, they're going to score. No way. Indeed, he missed. Wow. Okay, that is fate. We will now go forward and score. Nelson over the top. Win the header. Oh, Iheanacho. Make a run, please, Nelson. Oh, 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 oh. No, he stopped. He stopped running. Just... Oh, Iheanacho, I despise you right now. Oh, oh. What is going on? Iheanacho, in for Dumfries. Is this the moment? No, it's, it's not. Oh, what a horrible game. What a horrible game. And it doesn't get easier, guys. We have the draw for the semi-final. And it is Atletico Madrid. Oof, it's a tough one. It's a really tough draw. They have João Felix up top. He has seven goals. Pretty incredible, really. Okay, well, it is what it is. This is the semi-finals of the Champions League. You're always going to come up against someone really, really good. Is this going to be the end of our journey? I really hope not, because at this rate, I could end up bottling the league and then bottling the Champions League as well. And this would go down as the biggest failure ever. So I really need to start off well. And in fairness, the last two rounds, the quarterfinals and the knockout stages before that, PSG, we decimated in the first game. And Chelsea, we also did very well in the first leg. So maybe we can do it again. It's just this time we're starting at Fratton Park. The home fixture is up first. They have João Felix and Suarez up top. Surely that is not Luis Suarez. There's no way. They've got Partey in there. Ampadu. At defensive midfield, they've got Matip, Gomez, Torres. Oh my god, what a strange team. Thankfully, my team is fully fit and ready to go for this one. Uh, it's a good team as well. I would argue that we've probably got a higher rated team. I'm guessing Felix is probably 92, 93. I mean, is Nelson higher rated than Party? Maybe. Doesn't really matter. It's about the performance on the day. Here we go. There's no way it's Luis Suarez. It can't be. We are six seasons in. Is it actually him? No, it's not. It is a different Suarez. To be fair, I'd rather it was Luis Suarez because he'd probably be like 75 rated at this point. It is funny how he's number nine. Wait, no, it can't be. I need to just double check this. Let's go ahead and look in the player ratings here. Oh my. It's not. It isn't. It, it, it can't be. It's not. It's, it's the other Luis Suarez. I think he's, he's played for Watford or something. I, I can't remember. How funny is that, though? That is typical. Oh, no. Backer's giving it away. Don't let João Felix through. Yes, taps over. And I play it through. Hello. Rogers is in. Oh, and we're up against the best keeper in the world. There's no way. No way we're going to score with such a simple shot across the keeper. Oh, oh my God. Keep it in. Keep it in. Oh, oh that's so annoying spamming cross to keep it in and he couldn't but yeah we need to do much better to beat Oblak that shot was too easy too easy to save look at the pressure we're putting on them love to see that Nelson win the header oh actually just get it to Saka okay nice this is where we break through because they're playing three at the back Mason Mount now just dink it in oh my oh oh can you imagine if that goes in I <laughs> just got a bit excited there Okay, we are actually doing all right here. I think the main problem is they're playing with wingers, but they're going with Renato Sanchez on the right, for example. So he's not really a winger and they are overloading us when they attack. But then if we hit them on the break, which is what we do, we are counter-attack FC. We will damage them for sure. Here's Nelson. Go on, just hit it. Go on. Oh, maybe I could have found Mount instead. I think he made a good run, didn't he? Still worth a shot. Go on, Holt. Go on, Holt. Go on. Oh, damn. That's bad. Now we don't have a left back. Backer's going to try and get back instead. Ah, <laughs> Backer's trying to get back. Shut up, Matt. It's not funny at all. Okay, we're, we're fine. Even though I went up the pitch with Holt there. He's going to get it again. No. 
Oh my god, what a pass from Partey. He is offside, thankfully. Jeez, that would have been one hell of a pass. Imagine having Renato Sanchez and playing him as a right midfielder in a 3-5-2. What is Simeone thinking? I don't know. Here's Ampadu into Thomas Partey. Oh no. Oh, what a tackle day. That was beautiful. Now Cummings can put Rogers inside. Nice. And now Saka in behind. Yes, this is good. Have I got any runners? Kind of, but not really. Try inside now. Overlap. Back inside. Nice. Inside to Rogers. No. No. This game is picking out passes that I don't want. And now they're going to score. Tap Sober's not the quickest. Come on. Oh, this is bad. I have to slide. Oh, my God. They've got an away goal. It is an away goal for Atletico Madrid. Imagine if I slid in, gave away a red, and then they scored the pen. I, I will take the conceded goal, but this is, this is bad. This is not good. Here's an interesting stat for you guys. That was their only shot in the first half. Of course it went in. I've had four shots. So we've been the better side. But it just goes to show it's about who scores and not who has the shots. Thanks, Michael Owen. Beautiful quote. I definitely was quoting Michael Owen there. It wasn't something stupid that I would say. Yeah, the, the team that wins is normally the ones that scores the most goals. You know, Something stupid like that. <laughs> Here's Nelson. Into Mason Mount. I don't think the formation's working. I don't have enough. I, I, I don't know. We'll change it, possibly. And that's offside, isn't it? Is he offside? He's not. Holt. Why did I effectively stop playing there? I just, I, I guessed it was offside and just kind of stopped. I don't know. They're taking off Ampadu. I don't know who they're bringing on. Doesn't have a real face, so I can't tell. Here's Backer into Nelson. Is this the moment we get back in the game? Into Rogers. And Oblak is there again. Okay. 55 minutes in. There's still plenty of time. Come on. Oh, go on. Go on. Oh, my God. No. That would have been one of the best goals I've scored. The flick, the shot, and it comes off the damn post. Of course it does. Am I ever going to beat Oblak? Maybe. Am I ever going to beat the goal post? Maybe not. <laughs> there we go. On the left. Nice. Now into Cummings. Good. Mason Mount. Finish it. Damn it. Oblak's too good. We need to two-foot him. We need to get him off the pitch. Okay, corner coming in. Saka with the delivery. Day's there. And so's Oblak. Of course he is. Faulkner. Going to play it over to Saka. Please be onside. Nicely done. Go on, Saka. This is your moment. Nope, it's blocked. Maybe I make a change now. It's probably time, isn't it? I don't know what I want to do, though. I guess Gilmore... Dumfries, just, just throw some players on. Gale as well. Just something different. I'm not going to change the formation just yet. It, it could still work. Corner coming in again. Oh, go on. Nope, oh, Black's there again. He's going to get man of the match at this rate. It is actually ridiculous how good he is. Oh, Rogers, Saved again. Cummings can't score. I want to uninstall the game. Alt F4, uninstall. <laughs> The good news is, guys, there is still a second leg. So even if it ends 1-0, obviously I've still got time. But uh, I'm pretty sure I just saw Oblak wasting time at Fratton Park against Pompey. Come on, mate. This is our first season in the Champions League. We don't need any of that. Here's Renato Sanchez. He plays it back to Thomas Partey. Trying to get a tackle in. Yes! Let's go. No! Heavy touch! And that's their throw, isn't it? Nope, it's ours. Quick. Oh, they're making a change. No, that means all the players reset. I wanted to hit them on the break there. How annoying. Nelson into Rogers. Tackled again. It's not going to go to plan this, is it? I'm just... Oh, <laughs> sorry, Matip. Didn't mean that, mate. Oh, we just about got that. I need some support, though. Nice. Come on, Nelson. Oh, no. That's it. I don't think I'm going to do it. I don't think I'm going to get a goal. This is stress. Stress, 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 stress. Not really enjoying myself at the moment. There is still a little bit of time, but they've got a ball over the top here. This is bad. Get a tackling. Come on. Okay, switch, switch, switch. No, 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 no. 
Shao Felix is in space now, and that's 2-0. <gasps> Henderson, I love you. Win the header. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. Over the top. Yes, put it through. Go on, Gale. This is it. Big moment in the game here. Gale. Please. Yes. We've got one. We've got one goal in injury time. Oh, the Atletico Madrid players are on the floor. They're crying. It's not over yet. There is still going to be another game in Spain. But right now, we have just about managed to rescue. Not really an advantage, but at least a bit of hope. We've got one back. And that's going to be pretty much the end of the game straight away, right? Just blow the whistle, ref. We don't need to play anymore. Okay, right. We're just going to get straight into the next leg. Let's go. Well, unfortunately, we actually have a game against Leicester coming up. I didn't realise. Oh, that changes things, doesn't it? I'm going to have to use the second team again. Oh, can you imagine if I don't win this one? Okay, so Liverpool have played an extra game. They are two points ahead. So if we win that game in hand, we go one point clear. Oh, my God. It's now really put some pressure on me. We have to win games. They've now played two extra games. Oh my God, we're in third place. Oh, the stress. The stress levels are high right now. We've got a message from Ian Acho. Oh, please, come on, man. You've got Rogers playing in front of you. It's just not going to happen. And look at that image as well. <laughs> that is amazing. I, I wish Mount was further to the right and you could see the goalkeeper and the ball and the goal. That would have been a, a really cool image, but... I guess now it's the second team against Leicester who are in 12th place. If we lose this, oh man, I'll be fuming. Absolutely fuming. I'm going to throw in Mason Mount just to give us a little bit more chance going forward. And mm, Nelson as well, just to give myself a little bit more of a chance of winning this game here. Yes, come on. Wait, what? 2-1 on aggregate. What? It's a Premier League game. Oh my God, this game is so broken, man. It's almost FIFA 22 in, in a month and a half. And we have a bug like this where you carry your aggregate from a Champions League game into a Premier League game. How does that make any sense? Anyway, I don't care. We've dominated the game very clearly. Ian Acho against his old club has got the winner. And that means we are still the favourites to win the title. All we have to do is win the rest of our games. It is as simple as that. Uh, in the other semi-final, Man City have beaten Juventus 3-0. So it does seem like we're going to be playing Man City in the final. That's crazy. But it's not over yet. There is still another leg. And you never know. Juventus could turn it around. I mean, it's unlikely, but it, it could happen. Right, so it looks like they're using pretty much the same team. Although they are bringing in Daka up front instead of Suarez. Not the Suarez you're thinking of, of course. I'm going to go with the same team I started with before. We've got Reese James and Holt at wing back, Tapsoba and Day in mid in the middle of center, uh, the middle of defence. We've got Nelson and Backer. Although I might, oh, I might take Backer out. Hasn't been working as well as I'd like. Maybe Gilmore goes in instead for this one, and then Mason Mount, Saka, Cummings, and Rogers. Let's go for it. Come on, lads. This is to get into the final of the Champions League. It is one of the best stadiums in Europe. One of the best stadiums in the world, let alone Europe. It is absolutely beautiful. But we're here to win the game. Get an away goal. At least one away goal would be incredible here. And make it through to the final in our first season. That'd be an incredible way to end this series. You know I've mentioned it before. It could be the last season. I don't know 100% yet. If I lose here or if I lose the final or if I bottle the league, maybe I'll do one more. I don't know. Uh, but at this point in time, in my head at least, I'm going for the Champions League win and the league win as well and then ending it on a high. We've got to win this game though. Here is Nelson. Going to put that over the top for Reese James. Back in for Nelson. Into Saka. Over for Rodgers. Oh, I had to chip it. I had no choice. And that, unfortunately, was too easy for Oblak. And now here come Atletico Madrid. It's a lovely ball to Sanchez. And Zhao Felix makes it 1-0. 11 minutes in. It's not a good start. But to be fair, it doesn't really change much. We had to score in this game anyway. So... All this means is a goal will take us to extra time instead of just winning it if we were to win 1-0. So it's okay. I'm not going to panic. I ideally wanted to come into this game and score two goals. And that is still the target here. 
Try and get mountain. Oh, no. Oh, hello. Hey! How is that not a foul ref, you bald mug? What are you thinking? He didn't get anything. No touch on the ball whatsoever, and he completely took me out. Oh, my God, if they score from this. Thank you, Reese James. I would have absolutely lost it. And I can't get the ball over to Cummings, who was in complete open space. Oh, guys, this is bad. If they score again... Oh, please don't. Please don't. Yes, Holt. I don't know what you're doing there, but... Oh, really? Really, we're falling over, are we? Get back at left-back, please. Can't afford you to have, uh, have you out of position. Nelson in for Saka. Is he going to get there? Just about. Over to Cummings now. Oh, finish it. Now. Oh, my God. Oh, Black is not fair. He's not fair. It's, it's a cheat code. He saves everything. Please. Oh, my God. Well, he doesn't save everything. We still did score in the last game. So I've always got a bit of hope. I've done it once. I can do it again. Nelson into Gilmore. Back to Nelson. Over to Holt. Into Rogers. Turn. Good first touch. Into Nelson. He's in. Saved again. Oh my god, I'm going to throw my controller out the window. We've got it back again though. No! Oh my god, what am I doing? Throw that to Nelson or not. Give it to Saka. I was aiming for Nelson. It's okay, we've still got it. Good turn from Rogers. He's in. Still going. Oh, he's done it. Oh, I thought he missed. I thought he put it wide. Okay, 36 minutes in. And of course it's Rogers. He gets us level. Right, skip the celebrations. We ain't got time for that. Let's try and get one before halftime. If I can make this 2-1 in the game, 3-2 on aggregate, before halftime, that would be the dream, right? We've got just over five minutes. Oh, this is risky. Oh, my God, we've pulled it off. Oh, it's beautiful. Oh, my God, it's beautiful. Cummings. In for Rodgers. I think he's offside. I think he's just gone offside. It's not going to count. Oh, damn it. Wait, what? Wait, 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 what, what? It's onside. Oh my god. How? He was offside. I'm sure of it. Look. Watch this. Oh, he stopped. He stopped for a brief second. Oh my god. What a moment. Why is Joe Gomez not sticking out a boot? He could have stopped that. And Oblak could have done better. That is a double from Rodgers with 10 minutes to play in the, in the first half. He's turned it around. We are going through to the Champions League final right now. Do I go defensive? I, I don't know. I think maybe I just keep it as it is. Don't forget, they have to score twice now. If they make it 3 all, I am still going through on away goals because I have scored two goals away from home. They've only got one away goal. That's why the away goals rule is kind of dumb, to be honest. I know it creates a little bit of suspense and situations like this. It makes it a bit more uh, interesting for a neutral, maybe. <laughs> but, um, yeah, it can be painful, can't it, for the teams that are playing. Oh, my God, he's in again. He's offside this time. <laughs> that was close. It was almost a hat trick. My God. Atletico Madrid need to really sort out their defence because they need to score two goals. If they concede another one... It's only going to get harder. And I would say if we get one more goal, probably impossible. Go on, Nelson. Oh, I slid in thinking the other guy would as well. As expected, they are making a change. It is Paqueta coming in for Ampadu. That is an attacking change. They've taken off a player that's playing at DM and put on effectively a cam, really, an attacking midfielder. Let's see how that goes. Unless he is playing in that middle position. He is, isn't he? He's going to be the deep-lying playmaker. Oh, no. Don't let them score. That's offside. Please. Oh, it was. He hit the bar or the post or whatever. Henderson saved it. <sighs> 63 minutes to go. I should really make a change now, but we're going to keep going just for a little bit more. Here is Mount. Oh, Cummings made such a good run. Go now. Okay, that'll work. That'll work. Nice. Through pass. Billy Gilmore into the box. And again, oh my God, Matip, do you mind? Let's make those changes now. It is time for Gilmore to come off and Backer is going to come in 
Uh, let me go ahead and change to the 4-2-3-1 narrow. And then we have Backer playing as an actual DM. Uh, I'm going to take Saka off for Gale. I'm going to keep Cummings on. Just convert them to their correct positions. And uh, Dumfries. To have him at corners, whether it's attacking corners or defending corners, having someone just so physical is a huge benefit. And, and Backer's the same. He will help us out. Talking of attacking corners, here we go. Oh, man. I kind of feel like Dumfries should be the one in the middle there. We've got Tap Sober up as well. Day's there. Okay, let's try again. Mason Mount to cross it in. <gasps> yes, that's it! Cummings has put us in the final. It is done. It is finished. We are going to the Champions League final. Oh, my God. I hope it's at Wembley. Please be at Wembley. I would love that. Oh, I would absolutely love that. Look at this cross. He's completely unmarked. Is that the first time Cummings has scored a header? It might be. How many goals in the Champions League? Three. I mean, it's it's not bad. Noticed how he scored in the 69th minute as well. <laughs> so childish. I'll be honest with you guys. You know, I love this team. I love this career mode. Maybe it doesn't feel as special as the Sunderland squad. But the more I play with this team, the more I realise some of these players I've had from the beginning, you know, the, the Youth Academy players, they're so special. They really are. Cummings has had his ups and downs. He has come good towards the end. He's not on McKinley's level. Of course he's not. But maybe in the Champions League final, he can do what he's done here and just get us a winning goal, you know. I don't know. And I was just thinking now, being able to bring on players off the bench that just give me so much help and support it's such a great strong big depth it's a great squad and i love it i really do and we are about to take this team to a champions league final and that's a huge achievement within six seasons you know it's, it's pretty incredible actually i could have maybe done it quicker if i blew my money every single season you know the first few seasons i was really not spending all of my money and I was focusing on the Youth Academy players. So yes, I could have done this faster, but I'm so glad I've done it the way I have. There might be a couple of signings that people maybe think I shouldn't have done, but in general, I've absolutely loved how I've worked this team from the bottom up. Go on, Cross coming in. Oh, never mind. I'm so proud, guys. I'm so proud. This might be the last season, and if that's the case, then this is the biggest moment for me. Turning it around against Atletico Madrid to get into the Champions League final against some of those players is truly amazing. And I'm so, so happy. Morgan Rogers, man of the match, for sure. Of course, you will find out in the next episode who we have in the final. Of course, Man City, it looked like they were going to do it. But uh, let me just say, Juventus scored quite a few goals in that second leg and it might not be what you're expecting so you'll have to wait until the next episode to find out the result in that second leg I cannot believe how Juventus scored so many goals you, you will see so we have three games remaining in the Premier League we are two points above City we are two points behind Liverpool but they only have two games left and we have Sheffield United Arsenal and then we we've got Liverpool Oh my god, and yes, I'm blocking out the final so you guys can't see. Um, wow, the next episode is going to be mental, absolutely mental. A game against Arsenal, a game against Liverpool, which might decide the title, and then the Champions League final as well. Let's go ahead and get the game against Sheffield United out of the way. Second team again, they'll beat Sheffield United. This is actually mad. I can't believe I'm about to do this. Come on, come on. Come on. Yes. <laughs> a 1-0 win. Gilmore in the sixth minute. Jeez, that was close. Four shots each. Three chances for us. Four chances for them. Possession was very even. But we have managed to get the win against Sheffield United. So up against Arsenal, who just drew. Liverpool won. Okay, so they have one game left against us. And we have two games left. Oh, my God. And, of course, it's Arsenal as well. Where are they in the table? Let's have a look. I'm interested. Oh my God, they're in 13th. What is going on there, Arsenal? How? How is that possible? I don't know. But this is the table going into the final episode. It is going to go down to the final game.
It genuinely is. The thing is, right, if we win against Arsenal, of course, we are going to go top of the league again by a point. And then against Liverpool, we can afford to draw. But I don't want to do that. Of course, I want to beat Liverpool in the final game of the season and win the title. So, man, I can't wait for that. Uh, there's no way I'm recording it today. It is way too damn hot. I haven't played particularly well, actually. I, I think I've got quite lucky at times in the last few episodes. So I'm going to make sure when I play tomorrow, I presume, um, that I come with fresh, fresh fingers and fresh hands and fresh thoughts. I just need to make sure I win those three remaining games and then the season and the series will finish on a high. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this episode and I will see you for the finale, potentially the finale tomorrow.